Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice algebra equation from here? We have x raised to power 12 plus x raised to power 8 equals to 33. From here, let's write this again as x raised to power 4, then raised to power 3. On the law of it, this is this multiply as dx raised to power 12, then plus here, same thing we have x raised to power 4. Then raised to power 2 and is equals to 36 from here. Then here we have x raised to power 4 common. So let's a letter represent that. So let y be equals to x raised to power 4. Then we can write this again now in terms of y. And we have y raised to power 3 plus y square equals to 36. And in the next step, let's take 36 here, and this becomes y raised to power 3 plus y squared minus 36 equals to 0. Then from here, we can rewrite y squared as minus 3y squared plus 4y squared will give us plus y squared so this becomes y raised to power 3 then minus 3y squared plus 4y squared then minus 36 equals to 0 then from here we can group this together and we factor y squared out so we have y squared into bracket y left here then minus 3 left here then plus 4 is common here we have y square minus 9 here which is equals to 0 and in the next step we have this as y square into bracket y minus 3 then plus 4 into bracket y square minus 3 square and is equals to 0 from here then this can be written again from difference of two squares and this will become y square into bracket y minus 3 then plus 4 into bracket y plus 3 then times y minus 3 which is equal to 0 from here then here we have y minus 3, y minus 3, comma, let's factor that. And this gives us y minus 3 out. Then what is left here is y squared. Then what is left here is plus 4 into bracket y plus 3. Then close bracket which is equal to 0. And here open this bracket here this becomes y minus 3 into bracket y square plus 4y plus 4 times 3 that's 12 then equals to 0 from here then here we have two cases the first y minus 3 equals to 0 or we have y square plus 4y plus 12 equals to 0 and on this side y is equals to 3 and from here let's check if we have a real solution here using the discriminant d square minus 4ac where b here is equals to 4 a is equals to 1, b is equals to 4, and c is equals to 12. So when we substitute here, discriminant now equals to 4 squared minus 4 times 1 times 12. And this gives us 16 minus 48, which gives us minus 32, and uh, which is less than 0. So when the discriminant is less than zero, it means no resolution here. So we have no resolution for this side. Then, 
Now, from y equals to 3, recall that we let y to be equals to x raised to power 4. So now it means that we have x raised to power 4 equals to 3. Then to get x here, we can take you know the fourth root on both sides, that is, we have fourth root of this, then fourth root of this, and the power of 4 cancel fourth root. So left is x, which is equal to fourth root of 3. So here we have the value of x here to be equal to fourth root of 3. Now to check from what we have, which is x raised to power 12 plus x raised to power 8 equals to 36. Now let's substitute the value of x here. So we have 4 root of 3 raised to power 12 plus 4 root of 3 raised to power 8 is equals to 36. And uh, from here, we can write 4 root of 3 as 3 raised to power 1 over 4 and which is raised to power 12 then plus 3 raised to power 1 over 4 which is raised to power 8 now is equal to 36 from here then when we look at this since this multiplies from the law of indices 4 we go here 1 4 go here 3 and we have here remain 3 raised to power 3 then plus here the same thing 4 go here 1, 4 go here that's 2 and we have 3 square now is this equal to 36 from here then we have 3 raised to power 3 that 3 multiply itself 3 times which is 27 then plus 3 square that's 3 times 3 which is 9 is this equal to 36 also, then when we sum this up, this is 36 here, which is equal to 36 on this side. And then we have left hand side equals to right hand side. And hence, we can conclude that x here is the same thing as 4 root of 3. And that's the value of x in this given problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn the notification bell on. Share these videos. Give a thumb up and uh, you know, put your comment in the comment section. Thank you and see you next class. Bye.